Hello, everybody. My name is Cody, and this is my beautiful wife, Bridget. Today, we're gonna be checking out uh, some random stuff. A little, a little weekly roundup. Some trailers, a little bit of news, a little this, a little of that. Uh, so, like the video, subscribe the channel, and I think first, what I want to do is jump into this trailer for Sick. Mm -hmm. This movie is from Kevin Williamson, the writer creator of the Scream franchise, and it's a slasher film, very heavy influence from the pandemic that's okay. really all i know so yeah just i think it's like a home invasion type thing uh so let's check this out first there's your mask this isn't a vacation it's a quarantine a quarantine in style <laughs> are you kidding oh me? oh April. very oh, early oh, into the pandemic incredible mm -hmm. sick and it's all ours the only neighbor is Miles. Those are nice. <laughs> Disinfecting. Everything. I thought you were spending quarantine alone. What are you doing here? I wanted to see you. And quarantine can be fun. Party. Uh -oh. There's someone in your house. Mary, jump in, water's fine. Who is this? I don't know. That's creepy, Parker. That, that is creepy. Who's a mega? Oh, fuck that. Yeah, it's Blumhouse. Oh, oh God. Oh. <laughs> oh. They were yeah. what they said heavily uh, yeah. pandemic influence. <laughs> I'm excited. Dude, though. That, oh God! Surprise release Friday the 13th available on Peacock. Stream it. Um, and I saw a lot of positive things online. Viewer Anon, who's been a big person in like the Scream community on Twitter and stuff, uh, had said that once it gets going, this movie is like one 60 minute slasher chase scene, and it's glorious. The, I like that. I've seen a lot of uh, other positive notes like that, saying how it has a lot of old school scream vibes. I think there's a little bit of setup, and then it's just really intense. Yeah, fucking intense, yeah. Obviously, very stressful. Pandemic comedy, campiness to yeah. it. I'm, 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 I'm very excited to check this out. What do you guys think? Should we do a reaction for it? Should we do like a review for it? Something? I don't know. So yeah, this is from Blumhouse, which is why they said Megan, because Blumhouse, Jason Blum also working with james wan on megan you know what else i found out about the megan the writer akella cooper came out talking about the r-rated cut or the original cut of the film oh, now yeah. first of all i just found out she's also the writer of malignant Ooh. and she's writing the nun too so Shit. with uh the the great reviews megs megan's getting already we have not seen it, unfortunately, yet. Um, but 95% 90s on Rotten Tomatoes, certified fresh. I think this movie is going to make a lot of money. Um, but she, interestingly enough, she did talk about the fact that there was an R-rated cut. She said, no shade to Universal, love them. And I understand that once the trailer went viral, teenagers got involved and you want them to be able to see it. There should be an unrated version at some point. I heard it's on the books. <laughs> But yes, it was way gorier. Her body count in the script was way higher than in the movie. It wasn't Gabriel in Malignant scale. We haven't seen Malignant yet. We need to react to that, I think. Just straight up reaction. Uh, but she did kill a bunch more people, including a couple of characters who James was like, I like what you did with those people, but I want them to live. <laughs> it was merciless, but again, that was me. My sense or my humor is extremely dark. I have a feeling this means... Uh, there's a lot of speculation to it, of course, right now that there's potential we will get an unrated or an R-rated, nice. much more intense cut when it comes to streaming. Yeah. So the fact that we haven't seen it yet, I know uh, that makes me even more excited. But I can't wait to see this one. Uh, That's kind of cool. And you'll, you'll, you're, we're gonna do a video on this uh, on Megan 
one way or another. I'm not sure what it's going right. to be. Another trailer we missed this week was Renfield. <laughs> I have no idea what this, this is. This is like a Dracula It's something comedy. Dracula comedy. Yeah. yeah. The movie follows Dracula's henchman Renfield as he wonders what life would be like without serving his dark master. Nicholas Cage. Unfortunately, our reaction to the trailer keeps getting blocked. I will post it over on the Patreon for completely free if you want to check it out. Uh, and here's some highlights. Oh, fuck. Uh-oh. Okay. What the fuck is this? What was that? Barack. <laughs> okay, obviously we're dealing with a little bit more than just narcissism here. <laughs> All right, okay, Look. okay. There's exploding bodies, vampires. I'm down. <laughs> I'm Nicholas Cage. Don't forget Nicholas right, Cage. Nick Cage. I Cage. like Nicholas oh, Cage. God, I enjoy. Too. He's got a, a wide catalog, you know. But I like Nicholas Cage, and um, that just looks like a really fun it time. Looks so Absolutely, good, right? Yeah, it looks funny. It looks creepy bloody man i'm down with that it yeah. definitely was much more intense in that area which definitely gets me excited right uh, kind of reminds me of what we do in the shadows a little bit I, it's like i'm that i also almost just had uh hotel transylvania vibes yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like adam sandler as like dracula and nicholas violent. cage as dracula definitely more violent <laughs> definitely much more violent yeah but I'll, I'll see that. Is that Hell that kid yeah. guy from, what is that, Warm Bodies oh or whatever God, that you like? Oh, my God, yes. I love that movie. <laughs> that was good. Um, I think that's about it. The other positive thing, a surprise to nobody, Wednesday season two officially announced. More misery coming. You know we can't wait. Obviously, one of the most uh, fun shows we got to watch this, uh, this past year. We knew there was going to be a season two. I just wish they would announce a Chucky season three. Other than that, Scream 6 is only two months away, and I expect a full trailer anytime soon, and I cannot wait for that. There's this movie Blood also coming out at the end of the month, and if you don't know what that is, please look into it, because I want to see it. And of course, we already checked out the Evil Dead trailer earlier this week, if you haven't seen that. Uh, that movie, wow, can't wait. We're going to have to check out the whole Evil Dead franchise soon. But that's it for that. This is really random, random stuff I just want to talk about and watch. And thank you for watching. Like the video, subscribe to the channel. Check out a lot of stuff coming on our Patreon early because we're going to be gone for the next few days. But we're going to be posting. So that's really exciting. And we love you all. And we appreciate you. And thank you for everything. And that's it for this one. Till next time. Bye. Bye.